Breaking news from Stockholm. The 2025 Nobel Prize in Chemistry goes to three scientists, Susumu Kitagawa, Richard Robson, and Omar Yagi, for creating something that could literally change our world. It's called a Metal Organic Framework, or MOF, a material so powerful it can trap gases, clean the air, and even pull water straight out of desert air. So, what exactly is a metal organic framework? Think of it like a molecular sponge, but way smarter. It's made by combining metal ions, like zinc or copper, with organic molecules made of carbon. When connected, they form a crystal-like network full of tiny holes, called pores. Those pores are what make MOFs magical. They can trap, store, and filter specific molecules with unbelievable precision. Imagine this, just one gram of a MOF can have an internal surface area as big as a football field. That means it can hold a massive amount of gas or liquid inside a very small space. And here's the cool part. Scientists can design these structures however they want. Want it to trap carbon dioxide? Done. Need it to store hydrogen for clean fuel? No problem. You can even tune it to grab water molecules from thin air. The story of MOFs began in the 1990s. Chemists around the world were trying to find materials that could trap gases efficiently. Traditional ones like charcoal or zeolites worked, but they weren't flexible or customizable. Then came three brilliant minds. Richard Robson from Australia built early frameworks linking metals and molecules. Susumu Kitagawa from Japan showed that these structures could actually breathe, expanding or shrinking as they absorbed gases and Omar Yagi from the United States perfected the process, creating stable MOFs and founding an entirely new branch of science, reticular chemistry, building materials like Lego at the atomic level. So why does this discovery matter? Because MOFs are already solving real problems. Climate change. MOFs can capture carbon dioxide before it enters the atmosphere. Water scarcity. Some MOFs pull drinkable water from dry desert air, powered only by sunlight. Clean energy. MOFs can safely store hydrogen and methane, fuels for the next green revolution. Medicine. They can carry and release drugs inside the body with incredible precision. And that's just the beginning. MOFs are being tested in air filters, food packaging, and even gas masks for soldiers. The power of MOFs lies in design. Scientists can create custom versions, molecule by molecule, to capture anything from carbon to toxins. It's like giving chemistry a 3D printer for materials. You can design matter itself. This discovery didn't just add a new material. It created an entire field of science. As Nobel Committee Chairman Heiner Linke said, Metal organic frameworks hold infinite possibilities. They let scientists design tailor-made materials with properties that nature itself never created. The work of Kitagawa, Robson and Yagi has sparked a global wave of innovation. Thousands of researchers are now exploring new MOFs for batteries, fuel storage, air purification, and even quantum computing. Their discovery reminds us that chemistry isn't just about test tubes, it's about reimagining what materials can do for humanity. The 2025 Nobel Prize in Chemistry celebrates human imagination, turning molecules into miracles, and the story of metal-organic frameworks has only just begun.